which is brought to you by R and R Automotive. Oh. Highway 345. Oh. 32258815. So explain me, Todd, how yep. can Facebook cause a street fight? Well, let me tell you. Because one broke out in Sacramento last week. And a big old brawl. <laughs> Fighting this week. Yeah, that's right. Police say uh, that by the time they got there, though, the fight had already dispersed and everyone gone wet. But witnesses reported seeing at least 30 women yeah. with baseball bats, bottles, rocks, and all kinds of other weapons and implements of mass destruction. Well, two people even sustained major injuries. Yeah. P- police believe the fight started after one woman saw what she interpreted as a suggestive post on her husband's Facebook page from another woman. So you better look out. Stay away from my man. A street fight, 30 <laughs> women, baseball bats, rocks, major injuries, bottles, other weapons. Because of an interpretation of a Facebook post. Yeah, yeah. Like, wow. hey, hey, you were funny last night or something like that. Who knows? I don't know, but it, it happens. Right. happens. And this next one here, come on, man, you said no cops. <laughs> yes, an unnamed Washington crook was in the process of burglarizing a home. And when the owner yelled for him to get out because he had a gun. You know, hey, get out of here, gun, get out of here. Of course, uh-huh. you know, the crook yeah. took off, man. Uh-huh. But he also left behind a bag of goods, which also included papers identifying him. Okay. Now, the crook called the homeowner later that day. Yeah. And offered a little trade. Yeah. Some of the items he'd taken for things that he left behind, as long as the police weren't yeah. called. Yeah, don't call the cops. Yeah, man. No. Well, the homeowner, of course, agreed, you know. Yeah, sure. Why not? Hey, man, listen, uh, I'll bring back some of your stuff. You give me back my stuff. It's just no cops, okay? All right? Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, man, no problem. Well, of course, he didn't. He called the police, yeah. and uh, the police were waiting for him when the crook returned. And he arrested him, threw him down. Ha! You are still your... That's what, well, it wasn't maybe that much of a struggle. It was more like, okay, <laughs> you're under arrest. Todd, you watch way too much TV. Yeah. You think so? Yeah. See what you just heard at the Yes FM YouTube channel. Get the link at yesfm.com or Facebook. 96.7 Yes FM.